You guys want to see something? Check this out. Ready? Okay, hold on. Wait. Gonna move this over. You see that shit? It's so pretty. It's beautiful. Oh. Oh, it's so fucking pretty. People are like tweeting at me and talking shit and all this other stuff like, wow, you're on two mil and you just now got the one mil. You're fucking late, bro. And I don't. I have it now. I don't care. When my son is born, he's gonna be like, dad, what did you do when you were younger? You could actually call me dad too. That's the coolest part. Why the fuck is everybody white? Sit down and tell him the story about all the videos that I made. And then if the internet is like obsolete or some bullshit or like YouTube is just gone, I'm gonna have to go on to like a prehistoric Windows movie maker in order to play the video. Death is an old friend. Don't make me call it. Oh, it's just, it never stops being cringy. What the fuck is this game anymore? I'm gonna tell a story and I'm gonna show them every single one of these. All these videos will be like a time capsule just to be able to look back on them. I mean, honestly, if I did have a kid, they'd probably be sitting there thinking I'm lame as fuck. I mean, I'm lame as fuck right now, but probably sitting there like, why did people watch my dad? Or maybe he'll look up to me and like see me as like some sort of inspiration. Probably reaching a little far though. At the age of 82, after I'm washed up and everything's hung up, gonna, gonna go into a closet, open an old box and pull out that golden play button. Just take a look at it and remember what I used to be, what I used to to do. I can just imagine the nostalgia. Just pull it out, dust it off, all the dust flies off of it. I just take a look at it. I'll probably die with it. I'll be holding it on my deathbed. I'll die like this, just holding my plaque. Also, if I seemed a little bummed out, it's because I, I am. Actually, it hurts. It hurts. You'll understand when you see tomorrow's video. I am not happy. I'm just- You'll understand. I'm not even gonna go into detail. That was just the dumbest fucking thing I've ever experienced in my life. It's actually one of like the most depressing things that have ever happened to me. I'm gonna be tilted for the next week. And at this point on League of Legends, I don't even know what my identity is anymore. Everything's just fucked right now. I know a lot of you guys don't play League of Legends. I mean, a good amount of you do, but if you have had me added, you have seen me just go from playing ADC, which is like a marksman, to just spamming the fuck out of support until I got in the goal. And it was like the most stressful thing in the world to play ADC because then everybody just blames you like, oh, I the fuck do you die? Why don't you actually kite and all this other bullshit? And it's like an extremely stressful thing to just play it, period. Whenever I played support, I just kind of got rid of that stress. I, I didn't feel it. And when I lost, I was just like, well, I mean, I was a support. What am I going to do? I tried my best and you know, it's all my team. And then I was sitting there and I was just like, yeah, you know what? Maybe I'll just try jungle. Why the fuck not? Jungle can carry really hard. It has more of an effect than ADC does because as an ADC, you have to depend on people. I know it sounds like goddamn gibberish to people right now, but just roll with it. So I figured I was going to do jungle and then I do jungle and realize like I I'm garbage at this. I'm garbage at everything. So I don't even know what my identity is. And at this point, Dynamic Q is just getting to me. At this point, I've just given up on trying to solo and do everything because I just get my ass beat. So fuck it. Every single person that's around my rank on League of Legends, I'm gonna just play with all of them. I played with people in normal games and stuff like that, but in ranked, I was usually just playing alone, you know? But now, just fuck it. I'm just gonna pre-made, just five-man this shit, and then just then just gain ELO this way. Like, I'm, I'm just, I'm done. I need something to go right, because after today, I just, I'm not, I'm not happy. I'm not a happy person. I realize this video isn't going to make any sense whatsoever, especially for people that don't play League of Legends and just have no idea what's going on, period. But it's kind of a lesson. The thing that I tried to do with League of Legends, and you don't even need to know what's going on with League of Legends exactly, I am done fighting the current, okay? In League of Legends, it's a prideful thing, right? To get your rank just through solo only. Instead of getting a five-man pre-made and just stomping people, right? People have pride when they do it themselves. It feels like more of an achievement. At this point, I don't give a fuck. I really don't. I am done fighting the current and trying to impress people. I'm done. Dad, what do you do with that movie, Huge? Huh? Nothing. I, I, I'm actually using it as a coat hanger right now. I actually have a shirt and a hat over top of it right now. I just give up. I'm conforming. Actually, speaking of dicks, you porn sent me a shirt. I know a lot of people are gonna go and say shit along the lines of, wow, man, you're doing stuff really similar to Rain. He has a Pornhub shirt. And now obviously people know more about Pornhub than they do about you porn, but you porn was actually one of my first porn websites. I promise you guys, I am not being paid to promote a porn website. She just reached out to me and she was like, hey, you want a shirt? And I'm like, yeah, of course I want a shirt. And for you porn, this is one of the first websites where I could actually ex explore things without contracting some sort of awful virus anyway. Yeah. No. Oh, no, okay. Okay. He actually just shot the rocket off. Like he didn't even care. I have so many videos that say something along the lines of today is not my day. But today is really not my day. Just next video, just yeah. I just, I'm never going to speak of this to my children.